If you were to present me with a pickup line to tickle my fancy, what might that be? I would say, my dad abandoned me. So, I guess you could say I got some holes that need to be filled. Wow. <laughs> Hello, my name is Zach. Father never loved me, so I'm seeing if I could find maybe love here today. And if not, then I won't see you guys in the next video. All right, Zach, uh, moving on. Um, what up, YouTube? What's going on, guys? Before we start the video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Put on the post notification because I'm choosing two lucky people to give 50 buckaroonies who comment within the first thousand comments. <laughs> oh, keep your hands right here. Yes, sir. Also, guys, make sure to uh, subscribe to the Patreon to see the, uh, an extra question during the middle of the video. Or else. All right, let's get your uh, wingman in here, Jared. Ooh. Yeah. All right, Jared, well, you're uh, Zach's- Lover, former. Former lover, best friend, co-star. What kind of good girl do you think Zach should be dating? You know, somebody that's down to earth is preferably uh, a child of divorce. Thought you were gonna stop at child, keep going. No, <laughs> nope. Child of divorce just because uh, that's a commonality that they uh, would have together. Um, Happened to me twice. My mom got divorced twice for no reason, except for the relationship didn't work, but. Overall, just kind of nice, you know? Oh, nice Someone who could be. hold me at night while I cry. Okay, 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 that's good. I thought you were gonna say racist. Um, <laughs> that's but too. whatever. I'm super excited for both of you. You're gonna meet the love of your life and you're gonna meet your, uh, uh, your sister-in-law. There we go. He's not my brother. All right, let's bring in the girls. Well, Zach, are you ready to find the love of your life? Yes, I'm so ready. You ladies ready? Yeah. Hey, they sound hot. Huh? They, they sound like they really could be with me forever. We're ready. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Jared, are you okay? Jared's more nervous. Jared's just nervous. <laughs> You're the wingman, dude. I know. I'm lock it in. Lock it in, man. And turn around. Oh, wow. I feel like I'm at a pay less. Look at all these shoes. That's crazy. <laughs> Do you honestly think any of us will find love today? I hope I so. so. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Let's be optimistic. I love the positivity. It's a flip of a coin for me. You guys like being gaslit or no? I love it. Uh, it's my favorite. I love when I feel super stupid. I have no idea what's going on. Gotcha. Good to hear. <laughs> Good to hear. That's the one. That's, That's the one, the one for you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't he remember. He always makes me feel so stupid. Wow. Okay, wonderful women. Allegedly, I'm sure at least <laughs> statistically three of you are terrible people, but say we were at a bar, just say we were there, you see me across the way, you got googly eyes, you know, you're trying to receive my seed in the future, okay. some kids might nope. say. Okay. Um, right. What would be your pickup line? All right, let's start with contestant number one. Good call. Uh, <laughs> good call. Uh, what do you think about the, the shoes so far, dude? I think the shoes are very equality, black and white. In this climate, that's really good to do. Nice. And you got the pink on top, breast cancer awareness. You're really doing wow. it all. Very socially conscious. <laughs> okay, what, what is your answer? I'm not normally the one to do pickup lines okay. when I go out. Uh, usually I hope you just kind of come to me and I end up Biden. But gotcha. if it was my choice to do a pickup line, I'd probably ask what your name was so that I knew what to scream later tonight. Wow. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, I have thin walls. <laughs> and uh, Jared, who is here with me, he doesn't like screaming, so his stepdad used to, you know, beat him senseless. And, uh, oh, any okay. screaming, really, anything really triggers him, so probably won't pick that one, but thank you so much. Of course. Uh, well, you gotta let me know your standards. I'll switch it up. I have zero standards, obviously. You're here. All right, uh, number two, thick shoes. How are we feeling? Hi. Good. I'm in my walking shoes, so I'm ready to go. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. God, you looks like you're ready to go on a snow trip, bro, with those shoes. Right? I just don't get fashion, so that looks cool to me. Can I be honest with you? And yeah. you might want to leave. I do not want to use Vegemite as lube. I'm just gonna say it right now. Oh, I it's don't okay. Do it. I can I can sacrifice the Vegemite. It's all okay. right. Hey, he's cultured. Okay. He can tell where that accent was from. Yeah, very impressive. I usually get the UK. Okay, yeah, if you were if you were to present me with a pickup line to tickle my fancy, what might that be? I would say my dad abandoned me. Hell yeah, Sorry. brother. Daddy issues. I guess you could 
So I guess you could say I got some holes that need to be filled. Wow. <laughs> That was good. I wow. like that. Wow. When my dad abandoned me, I just never learned how to throw a baseball. <laughs> so, uh, moving on. Contestant number Rich. Uh, I see your shoes. Oh. <laughs> I was worried that whoever was over there wouldn't know what they were, but you passed the first test. Um, oh, she's, she's testing quizzing you. you. I'm quizzing oh, wow. you, yeah, because if you didn't know what they were, then we Flip might have to. Flip me over like a minute problem. math test that I finished first on, baby girl. Oh. Goodness. <laughs> And dude, look at her. She's uh, okay. sagging her pants. <laughs> okay. She goes hard. She's cool. Yeah. Or maybe she just she spent all the money on the shoes. She can't afford pants that fit, mm. so they're just sagging. I don't know about that one. Okay. Anyways. Um, Wait, is that pleather or leather? It's leather. Oh, Ooh. nice. You hate animals. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yikes. Wait, do you know what kind of what Air Force those are? Air Force. Or uh, Air Jordans. <laughs> Do you know what branch of the military those are? Oh, yeah. Uh, is that an F-15 backseater? I don't know Drop shoes, no. okay? No? Okay. She's testing you right now, and I'm testing you. Gotcha. Uh, are those off-white Jordan 1s? Yes. Gotcha. Yep. Looks Ooh. good. Thank you. I set them up for that. I <laughs> fucking knew. I was just trying to make you look good because Jared yeah. sucks. Wow. Um, how did I get roped into this? I don't know. I have to throw someone under the bus. All right. Yeah, Jared's easy to throw into the bus, isn't he? Yeah. Well, I'll stick up for you. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, I Zach. got you, buddy. I really appreciate um, that. Anyways, um, not much of a pickup line girl, but if I had to come up to you, I would probably say something like, are you going on a trip after this because you sure are packing? Whoa. Well, that'd be a lie. <laughs> and I don't want to date a liar, so <laughs> moving right along. We can make it work. No, we can't. Trust me. It's been a real point of... Emphasis in most of my relationships. Oh, no. oh man. He's um, big in other places. Like, um, do we have anything? No, he's just small everywhere. Small everywhere. Yeah. I'm lacking in a lot of things. I am five foot one inches tall. I'm the only person here shorter than David, which is pretty ah! insane. <laughs> Why are you throwing me under the bus now? I love a pocket baby. <laughs> I put you in my pocket. Just I'd rather be in another pocket, huh? Hey, it's no. for content, ladies. I don't think that way. I'm chivalrous, okay? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> All right, white toes. Let's talk about it. Oh, about my white toes? Uh, no, just you in general. Okay. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm, well, I mean, I'd say six out of 10 for the day. I've had, I don't know, X texted me and uh, I don't know, there's a lot there, so. Mm. Yeah. What about a pickup line, huh? Well, I'd probably come up to you at the bar and have a small talk like this and then just be like, well, I've had a really productive day. I've done everything on my to-do list, except for you. Ooh. That's a good one. She's I ambitious. Like yeah, she's yeah. got a to-do list. Exactly, <laughs> she's getting shit Business done. Businesswoman. I am waiting for sex until my second marriage. Okay. Um, Your second marriage. Is that okay? That, that could be fine. Okay, good, 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 good. <laughs> Ladies, you don't know this, but there's a fly currently flying around the production, and I thought killed this was a it. higher value set. Um, killed but you it. killed it? I killed it. Okay, good, good. Um, we're gonna move right along to old uh, Ronald McDonald with the... <laughs> oh shit, those go, those go oh on forever. Oh my god. You could definitely see on top of the fridge. <laughs> um, how are you? I could use me I'm with amazing, yeah. thank you. Okay, uh, what was the highlight of your day? Um, getting here kind of late, I think. That Probably was, uh, watching Family Guy too. So not being punctual is the best part of your day. Interesting. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> wow. That's hot. Weird flex. Hey, she, hey, she won't be late. The only thing late is, is my that period. A pregnancy That's the only joke? thing that's gonna that be was late. That was pregnancy joke. <laughs> <laughs> she Sorry. got it. No, I, I didn't get it. Just because. Yeah, but she got it. No, no, I never graduated the fifth grade. Um, okay, I'm gonna ask you a pickup line, not because I want okay. to, but because I have to. Uh, what would that be? So I usually don't go up to men at the bar because they still approach me regardless. So I think I would probably look at you, and if you don't come up to me, then I guess you're not interested, and I just keep it moving. Wow. It's kind of simple. That <laughs> got him, dude. It's kind of simple, I'm sorry. He's excited. I'm sorry. Yeah, I have a raging blood flow to my nether regions. Oh, but you can't tell because of, again, how... Gross. Okay, what's... Uh, socks, how you feeling? I'm great, how are you? I'm pretty good. Uh, like I said, six out of ten. I've had better days. Why the no shoes? Uh, don't really leave the house much, so I don't need shoes often, but... Okay. Yeah, okay. I think this is... She was like, you know what, I'm gonna, gonna leave, I'm gonna leave today. Fuck it. <laughs> I don't need them. All right. Why, why do you not leave the house often? What's your line of work? Uh, I mean, I'm an e-girl, so we don't see daylight much. If I would have told my grandpa who fought World War II that <laughs> that sentence was just said, yeah. J just for, for the idiots at home, an e-girl clearly stands for what? Uh, uh, if you were to define an e-girl, what would you say? Because <laughs> women should be able to talk for themselves. I mean, e-girls are just girls who stay on the internet way too long. Mm. Oh, you're just depressed. <laughs> okay. 
I didn't. I genuinely did not know what e girl meant, by the way. But now I know it. I thought Edu you were gonna. She's educating that. us. Is that like okay. Ethernet girl? You're all, you're always plugged in. Mm, possible. That's what I thought. Nice. That makes sense. Okay. That's cool. Do we move on to sparkle shoe thing? Wait, what about oh, my dude. pickup line? Oh yeah, you gotta. <clears throat> pick oh, line. sorry. God. This. I need the wait. I Save usually her. let the uh, the woman finish first, but you hate me already. <laughs> yes. So far, but <laughs> I'm so insulted. It's okay. We'll get over it. How you feeling? Okay, what's this pickup line? I apologize. Okay. Darth Vader's lightsaber is red, Anakin's is blue. If I was the Force, I'd surely be with you. Wow. That's good. I hope you're a Star, like Star Wars, Wars fan. I also like vitamin D, but <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna be getting much it's of okay, that. okay, I have some supplements at home. I have wow. wow. Well, at the same time, you guys should say your favorite Star Wars character. See if it's- I'd love to. Out. Ready? Yeah. Three. <laughs> Two, one. Anakin. Spock. That's Star Trek. That's Star Trek. <laughs> that's crazy. That A. Hey, was that pink skirt? That was a joke and you know it. Okay? That's why I said that's crazy. I love it. I love you too. Last woman. But How not are you? Least. I'm great. How are you? Dude, check Still out Still good. Dude, check out those uh, shoes. She's got a little lock in there. She's trying to lock you down, bro. Ooh. That's great. <laughs> that's great. She doesn't have the key. Dang. Oh, where what happened to the key? You have it. No, I don't. <gasps> so yeah, the key to her heart. Nope. Do you not have, I, no, I do not have that, but thank you. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> um, do you have a pickup line that might make me love you? They say that kissing is a language of love, so would you mind starting a conversation with me? I see it as, we're so primal, we're kind of just putting our food holes together, and when you really think about it, it's a little strange. But I wouldn't mind tongue wrestling later, if you don't mind. I used to watch WWE as a kid, it takes me back, not a big deal. Great pickup line, how are we doing so far? Um, what the f <laughs> <laughs> That was great. I actually kind of tuned you out for a second there. Most people do. Yeah, because I was thinking like, do. shit, how do I edit this out? <laughs> okay, and whoever we eliminate first has to sleep with Jared. And that's what in- What the fuck? It was in a contract they signed before this. Who will you eliminate first round? I'm only doing this because I hate you. <laughs> oh no. It's no other reason, okay? Contestant number six. Uh, Why? Is that me? Wait, one, two, three, four, five, seven. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, Zach, you just gave someone a heart attack. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Not that's, Daphne that's that works outfit. on OnlyFans. Yeah. <laughs> How are you? I'm great. How are you? Good. This will be our one and only hug. I apologize. Perfect. But I was interested sorry. in your friend anyway. As you should be. Yeah. He's great at, like, really. I'm almost something he, you guys could talk about it. <laughs> Nothing. Okay, perfect. All right, we always love you on set. We love you. Come here. I love you. Listen, listen. I know you've been here all day. I was just trying to get you out so you can go home. You're welcome. I got <laughs> you. I got you. Obviously, obviously. Man of the people. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Thank you. Oh, I think you forgot the rest of your skirt, <laughs> by the way. And turn around. Wow, this changes everything. <laughs> <laughs> we got a little dancer okay. over here. Dancers. Doing a little dancey dance? What happened? Okay, uh, contestant number one, two, three, four. What happened to your knee? Um, I slipped falling for you. Oh, shit, that was on the spot. Okay. Okay. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> that was real good. You guys are crazy. Uh, what happened though? Um, I got attacked my first night in LA. <gasps> Whoa. Yeah. Oh. By who? Yeah. Um, some crackhead on the side of the road. Happens. It was a vibe. My so Uber driver shouldn't have stopped her? for her. Are you gonna protect her? No, no, no. I don't want heroin needles coming after me. <laughs> Goodness. I'm sorry that happened to you. Well, make sure to check out the Patreon, guys, because we have that full fight video <laughs> on there. <laughs> Round two, guys. Zach, what are we asking the lovely ladies? Okay, say this goes well. I go to your family Thanksgiving, and your mom's there. She is, I'd say, 10 times oh, harder no. than you. Yep. I turn her guts inside out like a okay. war victim, mm -hmm. and uh, we fall in love. Who do you cheat on to get back at me? So who's like your celebrity crush, I guess, or? <laughs> that, that's how you got to that question? There's another way you can ask that, I guess. Did something recently happen to you, which is why you're asking this? Nope. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, let's Where, go. Where's the exit? Nope. <laughs> okay. Just kidding. All right, interesting uh, way to ask that question, uh, Zach. Uh, let's, uh, what do you think about contestant number one's um, outfit? Oh, very similar to before, but I see it goes higher. I, w I thought it maybe was just from the knees down, but it turns out it does go to your hips. Yeah, okay. it's good but beautiful. Simple, sophisticated. Ooh, look, sophisticated. Look, she's, got, she's got some rings, she's got some tats. She's got some tats. Wow. Your mom would have a holy conniption if you brought her home. But that is true, that is true. I can hide stuff. I hide it from my family. Forever? <laughs> yeah. That's commitment. And that's why they don't matter anymore. Oh, oh yeah, it'll go. always matter. She makes them fall in love with them first. Exactly. Gotcha. 
and then they just don't even care about anything else. Oh, that's exactly. a, that, that gives me another question idea. But okay, who who's your who would you cheat on me with? Just say who's your celebrity crush. If there was one celebrity that I could and had to because you were being the worst, mm -hmm. I would pick Nick Kroll because he's just so silly and goofy and wonderful that. He's my celebrity crush. Dude, that's awesome. That is really good. Dude, that's great. I can't wait for you to cheat on me. I want to go to dinner with him. I'll let you meet him afterwards. Yeah. You guys will be friends. Dude. Yeah, that'd be great. God, yeah, you're, yeah. you're a sweetheart. <laughs> you're a um, thank you. Contest I'll do it for you. I like that. Yeah, it seems like it. That was great. I mean, she's got a good sense of humor. I love her. Contestant number two. Hi. Um, How do you think about the outfit, dude? It's a little kind of. Oh. What like are those years? And they're my parents' birth years. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Oh, great. So when you're on your knees. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The placement was a bit questionable when I had to ask mom because dad left, but it was fine. Do you ever get a little scared that because of your knees you'll fold forward or no? <laughs> what do you mean? No, just a question. Um, no, it hasn't crossed my mind, but now I'm a little bit worried about it, yeah. Okay, be careful because if you lean a little too much forward, you know. Those things are gonna buckle. I tore my ACL. I'm just looking out for you. Oh dear, poor You thing. did tear, yeah. You've had a rough go. Yeah, oh. speaking of rough goes, yeah. uh, who'd you cheat on <laughs> me with? Um, well, if I found out that you had fucked my mom. On accident. On accident. <laughs> it seemed um, pretty intentional. To be fair, my mom's not that good looking, so that's already a loss. Mm. Um, but for me. Put her mom under the bus. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, why's your, why's your mom? Fuck her mom. Why's no, your mom no, out here catching she won't, watch, she won't watch, she doesn't have YouTube. Um, Everyone has YouTube, so. Okay. <laughs> well, I, I would probably, first I would gaslight you. Um, into nice. thinking that I wasn't upset because I like to play a long game, not a short one. You're gonna hate me in the bedroom. I know, God, it's okay. <laughs> um, but then I would find out whoever your idol is um, and I would sleep with them. And the Dalai Lama, based on the tongue thing. The Dalai Lama. <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm the in. tongue thing, stop it. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm in. Oh, my God. Jesus. Yeah. Okay, well, I would sleep with the Dalai Lama. Um, and while we're in bed, I would film a cameo wishing you a happy birthday. Um, and then I would wait until your birthday the next year uh -huh. and then have him send it to you. Wow. So you you would think that you're getting an awesome birthday gift. Yeah. But instead, she's sending me a video of her <coughs> sleeping with the Dalai Lama? Yeah. yeah. That's the best birthday gift That's I could ever ask. <laughs> Is you're Nick Kroll there? Because I'm on board. So. <laughs> This sounds like a big mouth plot. Well, thank you for being so kind. You're so welcome. And I noticed you're standing a little straighter, and I feel like it's because I made you self-conscious. You made me self-conscious, yeah. I apologize. I like that. It was a joke among friends. No, oh. I like it. <laughs> Does it seem like it based on you not standing properly? Okay. Okay. Um, <laughs> contestant number three. Well, since fair is fair and you slept with my mom, I would have to come back and sleep with your dad. You idiot! Yeah. Then you'd have to um, find him and i get to meet him. Uh, yeah. So, <laughs> no, win-win win for me. A win, win is a win. For me. You would get to find him, I would get to sleep with him, probably marry him, and I could make you be the flower girl at our wedding. Whoa, I like that. She's spicy. That's Jared's job. The, fl <laughs> the flower girl for so, Oh, I thought you meant sleep with his dad. <laughs> <laughs> Jared, uh, come on, guys. <clears throat> that was great. Um, well, that's wonderful. Thank you for telling me you're gonna sleep with my dad. That's yeah, really gonna you're welcome. do wonders. Um, hey, Toes. Hi. Um, if you were to cheat on me, how'd you do it? Well, similar to contest number three, I feel like I just have to return the favor, so I'd probably sleep with your mom. Oh, oh switch it up, dude. <laughs> My mom is an elementary school counselor and a God-fearing Christian. So if you think <laughs> yeah. you're going to get in there on that bush, you got another thing coming. You got a better luck getting with one of the presidents, I'll tell you that much. Um, <laughs> contestant number five? Yes. How are we feeling? I'm feeling good, but my mom's no longer here. So if you were to sleep with her, then I would probably ask you how she's doing. <laughs> um, <laughs> Hey, hey, I'm trying to go deeper in her than we buried her, baby girl, you know what I mean? I'm we trying to go six inches, not oh. six feet, what's we, up? We made it her, actually, so she's not buried, she's actually ashes, but... Um, <laughs> wait, so. I'll snort her then. I'll put her in my Keurig. So, I think I would cheat on you with Ashton Kutcher, because he's hot. And he's like a good man, I feel. I feel like I have hey, a little bit of so Mila bad. in me. Hey, can I say something? Yeah. This is the only time I'll ever say this in a relationship, I'm sorry. For this video, I tried to say things that were funny, 
And I think at one point I said I would put your deceased mother in a Keurig machine and drink her. Oh shit, no, no, you're fine, don't worry. <laughs> Have you already done <laughs> that? Coming to dark comedy, it helps me. <laughs> yeah, look at what she's wearing, bro. It you didn't even comment cool. on it. I don't think she's doing well based on what she's wearing. Oh, no, no, I am. I'm, I'm getting therapy. See, yeah, yeah, seems like it's not working. Need to do it. <laughs> Let's pick it up to twice a week, huh? Um, All right, pay for it. <laughs> okay, contestant number six. Uh, what do you think about the Cookie Monster thing? She's a little, she's a, she's a snack. Definitely. Ooh, that's a good way yeah, of looking oh, at nice. it. That was nice. She's oh, a nice. snack, bro. Are you insinuating that you have, you don't have your own thoughts because you're similar to Sesame Street, where uh, the Cookie Monster is a puppet, and you feel like men in society are using women as puppets, and then, and, oh, um, or did you just like it? I just liked it. Oh yeah, gotcha. no deeper meaning on this one, for okay. sure. I like it, by the way. Who would you have physical relations with? Well, first, I don't really believe in cheating in any circumstance. I just uh, cheat on your mom. Go. <laughs> <laughs> and vengeance is kind of a waste of time, but I will take all of your hopes and dreams for your life, and I will top them and uh, basically give head live my hopes your and dream dreams? life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's that good. It's also the name of my balls, hopes and dreams. <laughs> I like that. She uh, literally is gonna okay. make you crumble. Like her. Her cookie. Yes. Oh my goodness. Wow. Dude. All right, Zach. This is a double elimination. What? What? Yeah, I didn't even fucking <laughs> tell you. Oh shit. <laughs> All right. So, who are you eliminating first? <laughs> um, what was that face? I'm nervous. Okay, huh? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, uh, uh, who'd you eliminate? I don't know. I'm gonna pick one, man, I'll pick the other. <laughs> I don't think this is for me. Yes, oh, oh shit, okay. Oh, thanks, oh, thank goodness. goodness, I was gonna eliminate you. It's great to meet There's you. There's beautiful girls out there. Oh, I know, thank you. Nice to meet you. I love you. Thank you. Have a good day. Appreciate thank you, you so much. So okay, love you. Thank you. And the cookie oh, girl. <laughs> you had a much easier time with that. Oh. Hi. Hi. It's great to meet you. I don't know what the hell that is, but nice to, all right, fist, COVID. I get it. All right. <laughs> the Goodbye. Sun, the, yeah, have you seen bench warmers? No. Okay. Well, why, do I remind you of a character? There's a character in there that won't come out of the closet because they're scared of the sun. Yeah. Feels that sounds like me. Yeah. That was a good movie. Anything we can help you with? What's going on? Where did it all start is what I'm trying to say. Daddy never came back from the grocery store with the milk, and now I'm here. Oh, you want to bring your cookie and something. Which I don't know where something. here is. Gotcha. This milk? is a set in what? Burbank. Yeah. I don't know where that is. So, w w where do I go home? Uh, Not with me, this way. but probably this way. <laughs> okay, love you, bye. Bye, have a great bye. day. I think she's an AI, but. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Zach, we got four lovely ladies left. And turn around. Wow. They are lovely oh ladies. So there are four of you left, nice. and that means only one of you are stuck with me, which honestly, you guys are gonna be so mad when <laughs> you get revealed, but it's fine. I have a lot of red flags, as you guys have figured out. Um, yeah. But a question I have is, what is a red flag about yourself that you would warn a guy about? Specifically, Zach. My red flag is I tend to see the best in everyone, which, is not the best because it'll bite me in the butt. I'll end up over trusting people and then they end up effing me over. So I guess that would be it. <laughs> well, that's actually a really sweet answer. Yeah, um, nice. So you, you oh, think kind of like a cop out though. I'm sorry. I don't know what else to say. Oh, do you work too hard? <laughs> Are um, you a yeah. perfectionist? So My other one would be a, I used to think a grizzly bear would give me a hug instead of kill me. So <laughs> did you um, almost try to give a grizzly bear a hug? Dude, anytime I see a wild animal, I just kind of feel like they'll fall in love with me, but I'm sure they'll actually well, rip my well, eyes That goes out. with the first thing. She sees the best in people yeah. and animals. What was the length of the bus that you used to drive to school in? Oh. Uh, very short. <laughs> gotcha. Okay, That's you're gonna like me. There. Um, no, very sweet answer, thank you. Mom and dad knees, how we feeling? I'm feeling really good. <laughs> <laughs> Jared just whispered in my ear. He said, I need her. So I don't know oh, what that means. I don't know what it means. But he was so doing a play stupid. on like your tattoos hey, and stuff. Hey, I'll so. take it. Yeah, he loves you. Dude, uh, contestant number two, what's that uh, around your neck? What does it say? Palm? It says porn star. Porn star. Oh, yeah. I've never heard of it. What do they do? 
Um, I'm not 100% sure, I just liked the necklace. I don't know if this turns you on or not, but I used to be in a cornhole league in Georgia. And <gasps> oh my god, I'm great at cornhole. And we used to, I, I, we were named the Corn Stars. So wow. I, Dude, yeah, nice. I thought, I don't know, I just oh thought. Oh my god, you yeah. could get a matching chain. Yeah, we could, I guess we could. Maybe a little kernel. Yeah. You know? uh, what, what's your uh, red flag? Um, I would say my red flag is that I am brutally honest, which some may say is a good thing, but some people don't take it that well. Okay, so. this is great. What have you not liked about me so far? To be fair, I'm not a huge fan of the shoes, but I haven't seen the rest of the fit. So, Damn. you know, it could make up with the rest of the fit. I love your sense of oh, humor Oh God, though, I love that you said that because he <laughs> loves those shoes. <laughs> he, he's so proud of them. <laughs> and I'm very confident I will wear them again. Uh, no, I love that, I love that. That's just my honesty coming out, you know what I'm saying? Well, I hate your shoes. Well, good, <laughs> I, we have so much in That's common then. And, and you need to clean them, so. I told you they're my walking shoes. Well, start walking, because after this round, it's not going to be oh, good. Oh, no. shit. Oh, no. Test number three. <laughs> well, I would say I don't really have, I'm, I feel like everyone says this, but I don't really have a red flag. But if I had to really pick something, what are you whispering about over there? No, oh, that is a red flag. You don't have one. Go ahead. Oh, oh okay. Got oh, okay. you. Um, I would say that I sometimes tend to let people walk all over me. Like I'm too, I'm too. Not with contestant number two shoes, you get all dirty, I'll tell you that much. Yeah, <laughs> a bit of a curb it, it gets me in a little bit of trouble sometimes because I'm okay. too nice, I feel like. I gotcha. I'm sorry yeah. that that happened to you. Yeah. Contestant number but, four. Oh. No, it's okay. No, it's all right. I was going to say, you could. Sorry, take I was just walking all over you. Yeah. <laughs> contestant number four, uh, we love the outfit. Uh, oh, I keep forgetting. I like all of your outfits. <laughs> See, I covered nice. it since I forgot. Good yeah. save. Nice. We get it. You're here for our personalities. Yes, very much so. <laughs> there you go. I see you have a necklace that says C on it. Mm -hmm. Why? It's the first initial of my name, but it can mean a couple things. Like? You can use your imagination. Castration? Because I'm not into it. Castration. Well, it's She's, whatever you're into. She not likes castration. people that are circumcised, which you are. Yeah, I am. Nice. Ooh, I am cut. perfect for me. My boy made it out the hood like Eminem. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, I honestly, if I'm being completely honest, I think my red flag is I tend to get anxious a lot. So you might have to talk me off a ledge once or twice if we're out in public together. It's a lot to deal with. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, be I'm being honest. Well, I'm scared of heights, so <laughs> if I'm talking off a lot of ledges, that doesn't bode well for me. Well, I, I don't tend to stand on the ledge. It's more of a, you know, sit in the fetal position kind of vibe, mm. but. Gotcha, easier to roll off. <laughs> Ooh, like a boulder. <laughs> so right. you might not be on this earth soon, is that what you're saying? What, no, that's, what? that's too far, that's too far. You just said keep me from jumping off, no? Just an anxious ledge, not a... Yeah, figure. like a metaphor. Oh, oh, we're going metaphor. Yeah, yeah, it was a metaphor. Gotcha. <laughs> His red flag is he's too literal sometimes. Yeah, yeah I'm too yeah, literal yeah, sometimes. Yeah. I apologize. So that's your red flag. And I'm illiterate, but who cares? <laughs> I love the mixture. <laughs> okay, you guys can stop flirting with Sorry. each other. Sorry, we're all really cute back here. Yeah. Well, we'll see after this curtain goes up, huh? <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's no. a joke, ladies. All women are beautiful, that's huh? That's crazy. I've never seen one that's not. <laughs> Who do, you, who do you guys think I should eliminate? What? No. Doesn't matter, it's number two. That. Let's get out here. Oh, Damn, that was brutal. Brutal. Well, Whoa. okay, so this is the reason why. Why? Jared here. Yeah. Ever since he saw the shoes, he's been having You're inkling really into for, he's really so into it. Wow. And I don't wanna, I can't get in front of that. No, that would be rude. No, yeah. yeah. Would you happen to want to be in a committed relationship for the rest of your life with him? Um, That's a you lot know, to ask. It's on the table. It's definitely, okay. it could be in the cards. Say, yeah. Okay, say this. Say, I could put you on the table too. I could put you on the table too. Uh, okay, yeah. 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 This guy, huh? Dude, you the got, deal. Oh. He's you got really some smooth. bling in the teeth? No, nice. you missed out. You missed out, bro. My She's next rich. answer was going to be about my income, but it's fine. Oh, what is your income? She's six figures, it's fine. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's it's great. Yeah. I usually put my value in like family and love and emotions uh, well, and whatever it is. Like I said, my dad laughs and my mom doesn't like the whole thing. So gotcha. It's fine. It'll work out between yeah, us. Exactly. Eh? <laughs> just, yeah. what do you feel? Oh my God. I can't. He's already going, he's already getting down on one knee for you. Wow. Well, just cause you're also black, you can't see. Whoa. Well, once you go these, I'm not getting any other ones. You can't go back, you know? Mm. Mm. That's yeah. what they say. That's what they it's say. It's my business, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Okay, now ladies. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you know you bad. Yeah. yeah. If you had to describe your sex life using an app, what would it be? Do I comment on 
her? Can't, no, you're good. Okay, sorry. Contestant right. number one. Do you one. want to comment on me? Whoa. Oh. No. Oh. Okay, word. I guess I would use TikTok because you could spend all day on me and never get bored. Wow, that's good. And it's slowly ruining my mental health. No. That's yeah. Really that's In not. the best way possible. Wait. At least you're having fun. Are you secretly Chinese? Okay. I guess you'll have to see. Well, because. Yeah, I, I got that. Okay. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Jared didn't get it. He thought no, it was racist. It. Well, that's good because, you know, that's how he became famous through TikTok. So she no, I'm not famous. Famous is a strong word. Famous is a well, phenomenally know, strong word. I'm trying to make him look good. <laughs> I got noticed once in an Outback Steakhouse. Trust me, I still jack off to it. Just the thought of somebody knowing me, <laughs> though. Know. Contestant number two. Well, this technically isn't an app anymore, but if I had to say, I would say Vine because you'll only last six seconds. Wow. <laughs> That's good. And you can replay it over and over again. As many times as you want, but I'm I on antidepressants, so it's kind of hard to finish in general. Oh. So that actually means a lot. That's very yeah. true. And you know, he's opening up to you, and he doesn't yeah. do that often. No, I like that. Yeah. That's good. All right, contestant number three. <laughs> I would say Snapchat, because my anxiety would kick in after, and I'd be scared you'd ghost me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was just sad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hey, just come here. This is nothing. <laughs> just come here. You okay? I'm okay. Okay, I apologize for whatever you're going through. <laughs> All right, guys, so the next question is for Patreon users only. So if you want to see this question and answers, check out the Patreon. My phone. <laughs> you guys still flirting? Sorry. We're we were milking each other. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, well, the reason why that's there is because of the Patreon question, so seriously, go check it out. Uh, <laughs> if you want to know why they're talking about milking each other. Zach, who are you? Eliminating. I'm gonna be honest. Two of you are very confident in yourselves, and I feel like you could handle rejection very well. Oh God. And <laughs> and so it would make sense for me to eliminate one of you. Whereas contestant number green dress, <laughs> if I eliminate you, you seem like you know you might go to God's meet and greet, which why are you dragging this? Wouldn't out? be great. <laughs> but also I don't care. So contestant number three, you're out. <laughs> <laughs> See ya! No, but see, it was see. Very, the ghost was coming. It was very yeah. lovely it. to meet you. She nice did, to meet you. She did call it. Um, Why are you so awkward? Hug the ladies. Yeah, like, <laughs> well, I just, know. I feel like after you reject someone, you don't feel like, I mean, hey, we, yeah, we got yeah. a hug through the screen already. Physic but I'll take physically a embrace. <laughs> oh, decent hug. Nice to meet you. It was you. nice meeting you. Cece, you're awesome. Thank you for Thank having you, me. Thank you, Sorry CC. about the anxiety. <laughs> it's okay. You have two really good girls to choose from. Okay. Doesn't seem like it. What? That's kind of mean. That's wild. That's crazy. That's crazy to <laughs> say that. <laughs> He's joking. He's just, <laughs> right. most of his jokes don't land. That's what they all say. For this round, I know we're doing based off of it, but fuck it. Let's have you guys pop out. No! Oh, shit. And then we'll ask the last question. Ready? Oh my god. Wait, who are right. we going for here? You, this guy. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> who would you want to go for? Uh, the, the friend. No, I'm, just I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. Well, that He's makes him feel bad sure. now. So. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> he goes, no, I'm totally joking. He's hideous. I would never go. <laughs> <laughs> for our final question, ladies, if you were to say what your biggest ick is about a guy, what would you say? It, what would you say it was? I mean, if I had to pick only one ick. I would probably say when you have your dogs out for no reason. Like if you just have your like, you know. Your dog's out? Like okay. you're just like walking around with your dog's out for handsome? no reason. Like, and we're not poolside. You don't poolside. Like my dog handsome? No, I love dogs. I have a dog too, but like, you just, you know, your toes, if they're just, you know. You're just exposed. Yeah. Toes exposed. If it's no not dog. like a pool setting and you're just like stomping around with your dogs out, it's kind of an ache. What about like if you're okay. in your house? Let's say you guys are together. I feel like, okay, that's fine. Um, contestant number one. Okay, so to be quite fair, usually I don't get an ick unless like we barely know each other. Hmm. But if we're already dating, you could do anything that probably would give anyone else the ick and it won't bother me. But I guess if like we first start dating, the icks I might get would be like, I don't know, if I like watch you, I walk in and you're flexing super hard in front of the mirror, like to the point where you're like, uh, 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 like just like going yeah, yeah. Uh, like ham to the point where I feel like you're gonna fart. <laughs> that could be an ick, okay. but that's Other perfect. than that. No muscles. Other than that. <laughs> he goes to He's the got gym. zero muscles. That's perfect Just. then, as long as I don't see you. Subscribe, guys. Thanks for watching. We made our decision. Contestant number pink. You have won. Number pink. You, you said you liked me and she I said she did. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, it's okay, I'll have your friend. Well, you guys should oh. meet though. 
Oh, okay. Jared's you, want, you, you want to go out with Jared? You guys can yeah. double date. Come, come, come. Let's go on a double date. There we go. Whoa. Win, win. Wow. Beautiful. It's a win, win. We made it yeah. work. Yeah. Congrats. I'm in you love, Mom. Couple. And you said I could never do it. And look at her. What's your name? Keep. My name's Keep. Like you just like, like a the keeps. verb, yeah. Oh, like mom. That's right, mom. To, we're mom in motion. Wanna, mama want to keep me around. We're you know what they say? Love it. is a verb. Love yeah, because verb. you always have to work on it. <gasps> and my name's a verb. Yeah, that's. Uh, oh, I love you. Zach, uh, how do you feel like you chose? Because like she's way out of your league. No, I think I think women in general, and I, obviously I can speak for this because I come from a single mother. Um, they go for personality more than looks. Yes. Whereas looks are gonna fade. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're gonna go downhill, I'd say, at 40. Let's hope not. I mean, yeah, just maybe. rock bottom on yeah. looks. Just destroyed by the time I'm, what, 41? Oh, I mean, it's gonna look like I pushed you down a hill, like old, <laughs> old green dress. And you're, you're just, your face is me? like, huh? You might as well push me at that point, too. Exactly. And yeah. then, so if we can have witty banter, I think yeah. then we could have a long, jovial life together. That's perfect. And jovial. if I look good by 40, if you don't push me down that hill, we're gonna have We're gonna shoes. let Jared hit. Yeah, no. we're gonna let him come in and do the shoving. What? Gotcha. And you're joining, because you're coming from. Well, I don't wanna see Jared's penis. <laughs> 